The outcast on the border watches in silence. For his land has been taken three times over. And it is known it will not last. The widow of the mountain watches in silence. For she hears a heartbeat in the air. Hi. We're Slurp the World. And you're watching Austin Underground. We have so many buddies here and I love all of them. Should we should we go through and name all of our music buddies? But yeah, for for some reason here we have like a good mix of way too many bands, but also tons and tons of venues and bookers. And so like it just kind of melds into, hey, it's a random Thursday. Here's eight different shows that are going on with all of your favorite bands. And you can only go to, you know, four a night or so, but you can you can see a lot of music in like, uh, yeah, Austin indie music. Yeah, and uh, yeah, we also just like we've playing gigs with people. Um, it's like you only need one in. Like I, I think Sludge gave us our first gig, and after there that like we met people there, and then we met people there. So now it's now it's to the point where if we we pick a date, we like ask a venue. They're like, yeah, just whoever y'all want, and then you know we get to ask our buddies, and so we kind of have like this little community of bands that either invite or get invited and i don't know it, it yeah it keeps people keeps people playing you can't you can't really drop out of the scene without really trying because someone's going to offer you a gig somewhere <laughs> after we released music like it was like a big paradigm shift i felt because like before it was just like we were playing, we were doing we like our gigs were like uh, I'd say like every other week or something like that. But once we released the music, like my mom called me, and I'm an engineering major, so it's like lots lots of work consistently. But my mom was like, I saw that y'all release music. Like, are you still like doing this engineering thing? <laughs> like. Is is <laughs> is this still like? It seems like it seems like because she was like they were really good. I really liked them. So like, are you are you are you still doing school? And I'm like, yeah, no, I'm I'm still doing school. I'm hoping to do both. Is the goal. Sappy guys, there isn't anybody else that I would rather be in a band with because these. Aww. But like these are my best friends and so it makes every part of the process easier. Like even even in practices when we're songwriting and I get a little ah. <laughs> But it's just it makes all of those things easier because you have to spend so much time with these people, so it might as well be people that you want to spend time with. You know what I mean? So I think that's part of what makes it like what makes us want to keep going is that like this is just what we would be doing anyway, even if the music was taken away from it. And so the fact that we get to do a thing that we love with people that we love, it just makes it so much easier and so much more. Uh, I guess it just makes it what we want to be doing with our time right now.
follow us on TikTok. I run the TikTok, <laughs> and it just gets really lonely over there. <laughs> Yeah. Dude, wait, what was my favorite?